welcome to my channel. My name's Catherine from Soul Siren Tarot. Here to do your mid-May reading. All right, Leo. Now, I'm trying a different format. I'm going to see how it works. I don't know the quality is going to be. It's a work in progress. Let me know what you think. But um, thank you to everyone who stays subscribed, comments, likes, everything. Thank you so much. If you are new to the channel, it's a general reading. It's not going to resonate with everybody. If it does, great. I hope it helps you. If it doesn't, just kick it to the curb. Or if you know someone it would help, please do share. As always, I've pre-blessed the decks. So, all right, Leo, let's have a look what's going on. And what I'm trying to do is find software that allows me to share the cards um, as well. So we'll see how we get on. I'm going to the uh, energy, Seven Energies uh, Oracle. Right, okay, just so you know, I like to see where we are in the spiritual journey. Okay, so here we go. This is Call the Muse. Call the Muse is like calling in on your ancestors, calling in on your spirituality. Can you see the beauty? It's the messages are coming in, but you're being asked to go into your internal self and to listen because the Muse is all about your creativity and your, sort of your past lives, you know, where did I dance before, you know, where is it I feel drawn to, that's what it says and it's asking you to really think about your origins because I feel this is a Leo who's got the ancestors around them right now um, trying to speak to them, try and talk to them, trying to guide you onto a different path because I feel I've got a Leo who's quite frustrated with where they are. That's what I'm feeling. I'm feeling a sense of frustration as I'm doing the video. Um, like it's building in me. It's like I'm feeling a little bit angry, right? So Leo, I don't know if you're in a situation where you've been feeling like I'm going to go off here like a rocket. I am going to go off like a rocket, like someone's going to get it. Do you know what I mean? Someone is going to get it right, right between the eyes. That's what I feel. I've got a frustrated leo here okay let's have a look leo who is it who's been messing about with you what do we need to know let's get your messages okay for leo please tell us about this call the muse i feel like you've had someone take advantage of you and it's just not sitting well at all you're feeling very aggravated yeah told you right ten of swords leading the reading can you see there so this is saying you, you're almost down and out, Leo, you know, you're down on the floor, ten swords in your back, someone has really betrayed this Leo and I do feel like you're really tempted to go off like that bottle of pop, like I said, you know, it, it, ten of swords is also completion though and maybe that's where you're at, maybe, you know, um, you want to say your piece, now, I think that's fine. I always say my piece, right? I do it in the right manner sometimes. But I always say my piece. But I think it's important that you don't sit with an expectation of the response because that's where you can just let yourself get heightened and heightened. You know, if, if you in a cool and calm way say, listen, I'm just letting you know that didn't work for me or that wasn't right or what you did wasn't right. Don't get frustrated when the other person or, you know, it's not acknowledged by people in that situation because that's their defence. But I feel like you've got to get rid of this energy, Leo. That's what I'm feeling. This energy wants to come out, says Leo. Okay, page of wands. Right. Again, this is messages. This is messages coming in now. So I feel, again, it's you also wanting to put messages out. But page of wands tempers it with like a love-like energy, you know, a friendly-like energy. But coming next to that ten of swords, with that muse there, uh, I just feel you've had a smiling assassin, right? I call them smiling assassins. You know, the one of them who come up to you and they're there in your face like, oh, how are you? Oh, don't you look lovely? Oh, isn't that great? All of this to your face and behind your back, it's snipe, snipe, snipe. And that's what I'm feeling for this Leo. And I think that's what's got you down. And what they're asking with the muse there is just dance right past it, right? Dance right past it because I feel you, you did give it out with love. You genuinely gave that message with love. And that's where it got you, right? Because that person wasn't, they were smiling assassin. This person is a watch out, mate. And I just feel like you're ready to give it them. Yeah, look, look at this, right? King of Pentacles. 
okay this is you in your energy that's where they're asking you to move to come out of this forget that you're the true owner of this you're the owner of yourself of your life of your pentacles of your stability and i feel as you leave these idiots behind you move towards more similar energies because they've sent you the star as well there's definitely some healing required here there's definitely some releasing required here when you get the star but the star also signifies wish fulfillment and we've got the king of pentacles here looking i always get the wrong way around on camera looking at the star so i just it's like i want to say to you right as you leave whatever this this represents for you behind if this reading's for you as you start to walk away from it and you yourself move into your king of pentacles energy understanding your value right understanding your value because just because others won't acknowledge it just because others refuse to um you know respect it that's the words i'm looking for doesn't mean that you go along with that and that's that's the that's the worry for me that you start to take on their energy their opinions don't do it right keeping your start go, keep going towards your wish fulfillment because you're going to find a lot of soulmates who are wanting to come towards you in this energy good soulmates not Si uh, smiling assassins and as i say it look right here they come we get coming out together the hanging man and the devil whoever this represents in your life leo they want to keep you stuck you're probably meeting more of their needs than um you know you're meeting your own right so whether you take that as you see it whether it's a love situation a work situation but it's doing them more good than it's doing you that's what i'm getting out of this reading right and the hanging man is mirroring that ten of swords right the devil sits under that ten of swords so can you see here the mirror the mirror the devil the devil keeping you stuck keeping you stuck right a grip a grip on you i don't like this energy we need to get away from it right because that's how you're going to fully release that ten of swords get out of this can you see release yourself it's always hanging upside down the hanging man and i always think gosh they must have a massive headache and that, that's what i'm getting this frustration and this stress feeling that's what i'm getting right tell me more for this leo but you know don't let it i, I don't know why this telling me this don't let it i'll show you what's coming up don't let it um, dampen who you are. Don't let it stop you being nice to people. Don't let it stop you being, you know, sending words of love just because somebody mistreated it, right? Because then they win. You become you you become as bad as them. Sod that, no chance, right? The tower's coming in. Leo, there's a massive change coming in from the divine here to kick you to this hanging man energy, right? It's going to come in through a message under that page of ones but not a smiling assess assassin i feel it's you now putting those love messages into yourself call of that muse right taking yourself into a separate energy a different energy getting that can you see here like but busting out bust that devil out right that's what the toe is coming down to do kick them away from you right <laughs> so it may be that they have to move on from a situation it may be they've disappeared into you know the lurky dirty uh undergrowth because that's what devils i love it yeah devils tend to do but certainly the chariot chariot here coming under that king of pentacles now that's what i said to you you're moving now on towards more like-minded people people who share similar values um share the desires the wishes the wants that you have to right it's moving you into a better place and when we look here at all these majors look at these on the boats we get the star healing we get hanging man stop it stop staying stuck unchain yourself from this the devil is hanging on to you here the tower the divine coming in to bust it up and sending the spiritual taxi which then is going to take you to like-minded people up off this ten of swords that's what i'm feeling leo right <laughs> very powerful reading okay so chariot coming are you going to make the move oh my god oh my gosh major 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 majors leo 
I feel I've got a Leo who feels like they're in a blooming washing machine on the spin cycle at the minute. You know, your head is whirring because justice coming under the star there, the moon coming under the hanging man, this couldn't be clearer. As you now push through this intense time, Leo, very intense time, you get your justice, you get what you were meant to. It helps with your healing, helps to bring this wish fulfillment. The moon here facing those fears to come unstuck, mirroring that devil. This person might frighten you, right? And you've always got to make sure of your own safety, make sure you're safe and protective, take the right moves if it's going to evolve, involve some of that risk to get yourself away from it. There is support out there. Find it, use it. Find soulmates, right, who can help you. But coming unstuck here, facing your fears with the moon, facing the dark to come into the light, that devil stirring, like the mask on, right, the mask on. Smiling assassins keeping you in the Ten of Swords. But all of these majors, particularly with the tower there, the chariot to bounce you on, justice, you know, the divine is taking you to your good uh, karma, you know. Leave them behind, they'll get the ship. But you're heading to a beautiful brand new beginning. But the question is, will you allow it? Will you unstick yourself, Leo? That's what I'm getting. So I want you to be strong, right? I want you to be strong. I want you to really go into your spiritual self because because i've got a leo here who's not happy and this will look at this page of swords coming under under here whoever this is whoever it represents again for you leo the spying the watching the keeping an eye on how you react i feel this person i do feel it's a narcissist i do right or it just might be you find yourself surrounded by narcissistic energies but whoever this person is i am telling you now that they're doing tests on you right the throwing out tests it might be comments uh it might be uh you know you might have someone who your friend who you've been speaking to and all of a sudden they're starting to be the friend to say you react they might be saying certain things to you like oh you know i used to like gravy now i don't like it just when you've made a special gravy you know they just it's stuff but they're just trying to see how you react right how you respond so they know how to keep you down because it's with that ten of swords that devil they're looking at how can we keep that person's confidence low keep them down eight of swords honestly keep them stuck in this web of deceit because they know this tower is coming i'm telling you now they know this tower is coming they know that you are getting to the point where you've had enough right they sense it they feel it often with a narcissist well all the time with a narcissist because they're not thick they're clever what they do is they push you to the brink and then they pull it back and that's what i feel that's why we feel is we talk about cognitive dissonance because you're constantly trying to make sense of what's going on you can have someone who's ugly and horrible with you the night before you get up the next day and you're like oh the nicest pie what happened you know did i wake up in my dreams in my sleep not knowing what i'd done and you know we've had a whole conversation because the winds of change have happened here right and they don't explain themselves for how upset they were they love to upset you at night right but they're trying to keep you locked in this web of deceit that's what they're trying to do the divine isn't going to allow it so my advice to this leo whoever it is i'm telling you now Either you make the change or the divine will. Either you make the change or the divine will. Because you, eight of pentacles, king of pentacles, there, the chariot, you are going on your new legacy journey. You are going on to what was your destiny. And this person's been stopping that. I assure you, this person sees how good you are. This person knows how talented you are. This person knows things you do they can't possibly do they cannot mimic it they're not supposed to this is your unique ability but they do not like it and that's what they've tried to block leo they're asking you to put the work in they're asking you to free the dark energies from around you to put all of that foundation into yourself all of that energy you've been putting into this one turn it around leo and put it into yourself that's what they're asking right honestly smiling ow assassin <laughs> yeah <laughs> whoop whoop it's these and these and these wow look let me show you right the send of the nine of pentacles absolutely with the star and justice you will get what you deserve this is the empress in the minor arcana they're assuring you with it coming straight out after the eight you will definitely get 
what what is yours leo what you deserve when you decide to just go after what you desire regardless of what anyone else wants you to do right they do not like it for a pen uh, for a cup seer they feel dissatisfied but it feels like it's because what they're doing they can see you pulling your energy back right can you see they're like thirsty out for it i feel in this reading this represents you here with this cup you know they're, they're trying to drink you in trying to drink you in and keep you stuck with that hanging man there and you're not doing it push through your death and rebirth here push through this death and rebirth go through this transition ace of pentacles comes through right you've had you had the king saying these people are here and you are your own king know your value put the work in eight of pentacles nine of pentacles it comes to fruition you get the ace of pentacles death and rebirth death and rebirth is painful but i tell you what it's so worth it it is so worth it and i want you to see it like that like once you've been through the process once because you go through it several times because the massive growth that you're going to have on your journey right you do you do but you get better at it it gets easier because you find your way because the more you value yourself the less you uh, put your value into other people's opinions or what they say to you therefore you know the rug doesn't get ripped from under you the minute they take it away you're not in that vulnerable position right that's what i'm feeling sorry i don't know i'm going there i'm going to the fairies send me a fairy to start crowning this reading because it's absolutely stunning leo it's all yours get rid of these people who are trying to hold you back right because they're holding your progress back your destiny come on magician right the dreamer honestly you can't make it up look at the beauty in that card i love these cards it says embrace your true purpose well that's what we've been saying throughout the reading begin a new adventure and above all trust yourself right trust yourself leo because what whatever you do when you're doing something on the daily that you love and enjoy and you're not putting up with the bullshit of smiling assassins or people who manipulate and try and control and you free yourself up to be you it doesn't matter what you've got because you can't buy that beautiful feeling inside of yourself and that's what they're asking you to lean towards right because i feel someone's been sucking the life out of you leo just sucking it and i say someone it can be a job it can be a job it can be whatever it can be a job it can be a person i mean gosh i've been there where it's been everything where no matter where i've looked around i thought bloody hell, can't move can't move you know and you have to just make those brutal decisions right to step back and come back into self come back into self right because that's who you are let's take an animal spirit I'm just going where i'm called to i love playing with cards right i'm called to the animal spirits for leo please what have we got for leo with the dreamer Tr trust yourself watch and wait right and they've sent me two i don't know what that one is but i'm gonna take it right i'm just I'm going all over the place here right honestly it's because i'm used to doing things in a certain way right watch and wait seahorse spirit i am telling you you will as you start to make these changes and pull away observe right don't get caught up in reacting to how other people respond to it well react to it they react to it don't get caught up in the mire sit back and observe it's the best thing you can do when you're in a situation of conflict or you're not sure of if, 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 if the people or the situation is responding in a way that's good for you or not watch and wait you can overcome any obstacle rhino spirit and i just feel it's a warning here as well with the tower whatever it is that's coming in whatever it is you're going to change because whoever this leo is it's significant just trust in yourself overcome any obstacle sits there right trust yourself can you see the path is going to his castle remember male or female there will be dark bumps in the road you can't see them on here but there will but just trust that you will find your way through it because you're being divinely guided you're dancing with the universe all right leo 
So I don't know who this reading's for. Very powerful. Um, I think once you realise and come to terms with it, you are going to get frustrated. You are going to be telling this, giving this person a piece of your mind. But I come back to what I started with. Don't be expecting the response back of, oh, yeah, you're right, I was awful, I was this. You don't get it. Just know um, that you've done it in the right way and that you're powering forward because I think that's what this is about. It's like revisiting lots of aspects of your life to really think about where you are on your journey journey all right leo i'll leave it there hope you enjoyed the reading if you did and you haven't already please do subscribe like comment help others um and uh, i'll leave it there i will be back for your may read uh, june june readings i don't know who this format is I'm, i'll work with it for a few days weeks see if we can get it working if we don't we go back but we'll see how we go all right love and light to my gorgeous leos and i'll see you in june